Huh? Where's Axial? Shouldn't he be here? He ran away without saying a word. He's been gone for three days now. I see. That's good. Making his ma worry is just a sign that he's growing up to be a mature demon. <laughs> Axel, I know you're worried. You don't have to try to hide it from me. Ma? What if... What if I said... What is it, Axel? What if I had to go away for a while? What would you do? Oh, what's this about? Are you worried about us? It'll be fine, don't worry. You can concentrate on your work, and I'll take care of our home. <coughs> what's wrong, Ma? Did you get another job? You shouldn't strain yourself like that. It's just the dust. Anyway, isn't it time for you to go to work? Yeah, in about ten minutes. It's perfect for a demon. Well, I'll be back later. All right. Don't work too hard. Whoa! What are you doing here? Is family really that important? It looks to me like they're just dragging you down. Huh? Do you want Mr. Axel to succeed or something? Meow. That's not what I meant. But I mean, if only he hadn't let his little brother come on that live show. Oh, I remember. I saw that show too. I mean, an angel shouldn't say this, but no demon should do that on camera. I remember hearing booze from every direction. Are you into that sort of stuff too, Axel? Mr. Axel, what happened then? Meow. Axel and I were fighting at the time, so I felt like I needed to do it even more. Mr. Axel. Enough of this! Right now, my little fans are more important than my brother. Let's go! Okay, chapter four, The Dark Hero. And this is the last chapter of uh, The Dark Hero Days in Disgaea 2. Okay, so uh, last episode, I finished chapter three and whatnot. Um, more expensive stuff. Let's do it. Okay. Cool. And uh, no, no, I do not want to go. Okay, thank you. And just come in here to. Okay, so I still have three million health, but. Um, figured I would just sell. Um, things that I don't really need. Um, because I just bought a lot of these to, uh, uh, to raise my, uh, shop level. So one of the annoying things in this game that they definitely improved on in later entries is the, uh, is the, uh, uh, the, like, item mechanics, where everything is in just one big long list, that it's not hard to see everything in there, um, that's definitely an improvement. Because, like, I will say that this is rather, um, annoying to have, like, all of that. Like, just ready. Like, it's just super annoying to have so much stuff. And you have to go through, like, the list, like, several times. Um, so I'm going to do more expensive stuff uh, one more time. And then I might do... Uh, I might level it up, like, one more time before I do the last map. Um... 
but just doing this to get some good stuff prior to going in. Ooh, I can just barely buy this. And it doesn't even increase it all that much. Um, yeah. So, um... Okay. So that's beside the point. I'm gonna save. And actually, what I do want to do is I will show you how I, uh, ground. So go to Dragon Square. I had to do Unwelcome Guest to unlock this. You had to, uh, uh, fuse all the enemies in this stage, which was the uh, five wolves, into one enemy. Uh, I would suggest doing it before you unlock the Dark World, or the Dark Guide, because you will be forced into the Dark World after you do it. So, there is a better way to do this grind, where you just have it, but that's only if you're going for the items. So, basically what you do is, normally you would just get uh, one thief and a bunch of uh, Beastmasters, but I don't do that. What I do is... Um, damn it. Okay. Whatever. Um, I take you, and I take Axel. I lift Axel. I throw him. Throw him over here. Lift. Throw. Okay. And I take Ram. I lift. Lily. Then I will. Um, actually, what I will do. Is there anyone. Uh, you have another pair of slippers on. I'm gonna. Uh, take those off. And I'm gonna put them on you. Which will allow me to do this without having to, um, without having to throw anybody. And I can now come over here and uh, take consciousness. So now they're asleep and they won't be taking actions, which leaves me to be able to do, uh, this. So do that. Uh, take some human -y character that is able to lift things. And, and you. Uh, oh yeah. yeah, you need the tech to do this. So basically, you would get a bunch of these, put them out here where there's no ranged attack. Uh, this will disappear because of the dark sun effect, uh, which is a thing that you'll see. And. Um, after that, um, you throw the person here, and then you just have all the Beastmasters attack while the thief takes the consciousness. And then um, the other thief will uh, put poison, or the same thief will put poison on it, but alternate poison and consciousness to keep it sleeping, but always, uh, um, always doing damage. So what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to um, I think this uh, wow. for the sake of what I'm trying to do. So disperse damage just, just so I don't kill myself. Um, going to okay. um, I don't want to accidentally fuck it up. So what I'm going to do is I'm gonna do this, come over here, do health, and do consciousness. And you always have to end it with consciousness, or else the person will be awake. And what I'm trying to do is I wanna do a combo, so the combo or so the bonus gauge will go up. So now um uh, now I'm just gonna be moving everyone uh, up for when I can then do ranged attacks. Uh, and after that, it'll just be a matter of rinse and repeat. So, uh, you'll see me speed it up right now.
Okay, and that's how you do it. So basically it's just a matter of rinse and repeat with various of the same things. Um, I'm not, uh, yeah, so that's basically how you do it. And now with that I can, uh, I could put one of these on, but I don't really want to. Um, the spear's better. That bow is better. I think I'll just put the goddess dress on him. <laughs> yes, take your dress. Um, well, actually, I guess I shouldn't because in case I forget to take stuff off. Okay. And. Now I have a bit more money. Still can't buy very expensive stuff, but um, we'll buy that in case I uh, forget, and then that for another one, and then I'll just have to make sure. So, so long as I don't have things really equipped, you, I should probably... I'll buy another monster weapon for uh, the cat. I just have to really make sure I take that one off. Um, okay, let's go. Orphanage. This sure brings back memories. I was here a long time ago, too. Oh, you too? What a coincidence. I'm from a different orphanage. I worked hard to get where I am now. Oh, so you're not really related to your mom? Meow. Nope. Ma took me in and raised me. <laughs> I'm just <laughs> joking with you. <laughs> oh? Mr. Axel, you have great timing. Now, I don't know if you were lying or not. Why would you lie like that? Are you dumb, empty-headed, or do you just want to be picked on? <laughs> a hero must have a mysterious past. Kids love heroes with a dark side. I bet I get swarmed as soon as they see me. It reminds me of my little brother when he was younger. Yep, you're already getting swarmed by monsters. What? <laughs> I'm pretty popular, huh? Remember, only one autograph per person. Yes. Okay. Uh, enemy boost 100%, but not worried about that. Um, boop, boop, boop. Really should buy some more shoes and glasses as well. Uh, 
that, okay. Okay, and... Oh, wow. Surprised. Um, um, let's go over here, setting ally effect on, because I don't know what Raiden missile looks like. Okay, why aren't you taking damage? Immune to non-attribute special attacks. Okay. God damn it. Oh well. Just wanted to see what Raiden missile looked like, but forgot to turn it off. Okay. So that, that is one of the more interesting things about earlier games, where they just unabashedly put in, like, immune to this. What the hell? Why are you doing this? You're supposed to be a guest. Ow! He broke one of my phones! I'm telling the teacher! What is it, everyone? Did Warusaski and Dadako break something again? Huh? What, what's going on? Oh! Are you supposed to be that visitor? Man, I didn't think those hoodlums were from here. That was unexpected. Oh, I'm sorry. Looks like they mistook you for other demons. Oh, no. As my way of apologizing, I'll let those kids be my extras. What do you say? Happy? The kids were looking forward to this, too. Um, you're an evil ranger, right? <laughs> Pleased to meet you. Looks like they thought you were an evil ranger. Well, he's acting like he didn't hear her say that, so we shouldn't worry too much. That's precisely why we should. But it sounds like this could get interesting, so I don't care. Yes. Okay. And then come over here. Drop some heals on that bismuth. And then let's save. Yeah, I remember Axum would take me a lot longer when I was a kid, because I didn't know about grinding in the dark world. Principle matters. Okay. What are you? So attack plus one, no range, enemy boost. Okay. I see where this is going. Uh, let's do that. Oh, oh so close. Uh, death wing. Don't remember death attack. Cool. Um, let's turn ally effect off. Uh, yeah, there you go. Okay. Uh, God, I wish I could get her a better gun. Well, I could, but it's not all that important. Um, Okay. Oh, okay. So the Geo Blocks are one of some of the moving ones. Okay, that's not bad. It's interesting. I do find it interesting how if there's a treasure chest, enemies just go for that one instead. Um, okay. 
be one of the last ones, so I'm, a <laughs> I'm just going to take... Oh, wait. Huh. Weird. Uh, I'm just going to unequip these. You can go in barehanded. i take that off. Uh, I'll just go in here and buy a generic monster weapon. Um, there. 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 Um, save. Go, go, go. Yeah, orphans love you, darling. Okay. energy at that age. I remember my little brother was like that once. That day, we never got to make up before the show began. <laughs> I got your little brother. Help me, bro! Just hang in there. I'll help you out. Axel, darling, you have to abandon him just like we discussed earlier. Yeah. Let go, my brother! Ultimate Miracle Magnum Hyper Kick, go! <laughs> But that's not what we're talking about! There you go, Axial! I beat up the evildoer! Here, come to me! Bro! There, there, there. I know it was scary, but it's all over now. <laughs> <laughs> I was so... <sighs> Shut up, kids! I was just getting to the good part! Mr. Axel, stop daydreaming and look around you. Oh, shit. Man, these kids look violent. No, they're land brokers. What? Damn it! You guys don't know when to stop! We won't let you take our orphanage! It's not smart to get involved in other people's problems. Those kids seem like they can handle this themselves. Well, see you later! Hold it right there! I've never seen you before. I doubt that. I'm so famous, you must have seen me somewhere before. Oh, I see. They hired some help. Fools. It'll only take a second to beat up someone like you. Go, fellas! It's all a mistake! Now this is getting interesting. I guessed right. Okay, so this guy just asked for death because I was gonna leave. Like, Axel was gonna leave and let everyone be them best selves. See how much damage you do with nothing on you. God, yes. That's what I look for in... Uh, doing this. 
I debated whether I should get this guy or not, but I'm just gonna do that. Okay. Um. Okay. There's that. And then there's this. Lightning spear. Okay. Dram. Mega wind. Oh. Uh, do I do find it interesting how the big thing that really made Axel's life super shit was him being like a normal hero guy for his brother. Like him saving his brother being very undemon like is what ruined his career. <laughs> and that's like what the. Oh yeah, I forgot that. Hey, look. Forgot that uh, she was out when I did the stage. Um, I just find that interesting. Um, damn. Okay. Because it's like, oh, he was an actual hero. But he wasn't a demon and a dark hero. Which, I'm not sure what dark hero is supposed to mean. I'm guessing they it's supposed to be like a type of anti-hero. Or that's the way that's intended to be read into but I'm like I feel like that's just so I feel like that's just more of something he calls himself more than anything like it doesn't have any actual meaning oh god I think I just saw an interesting yeah <laughs> so there's no lifting invincibility encroaching game over so this battle has a strict time limit um and it's this right here. So, can't lift anything, so you can't get any of the Geo Blocks off. They're invincible, it spreads, and if anything is on these, it's game over. Like, anything. Not just, um, uh, enemy characters or, or, uh, or non enemy characters. It's if anybody is on those. Uh, things. It's done. But I don't have to worry about that because super strong. Thank you for getting rid of those land brokers. Yeah, well, I'll be back later for the reward. Also, I don't want to hear your sob story, so just keep it to yourself. They're trying to clear the area to build an overlord's castle. Oh, good for you. Uh, see ya. We fight a lot, but this orphanage is our home. We're a family, sort of. We don't have anywhere else to go. Family, huh? Yeah, we won't be able to kick the principal anymore if our house is gone. Then what are we supposed to do? If we only had the money, we'd be able to keep this place. Huh? But didn't you spend your whole budget on this place? Shh. I see, so that's what's going on. Well, then you can leave it to me. I'll pay you once I get back on TV. It'll be an investment, and I'll only charge you about 40% interest. Whoa! Only Mr. Axel can say things like that and think it's a fair deal. Um, are you even popular? I thank you for your thoughtfulness, but I'm afraid I can't take that offer. We need the money now. We can't count on something that might not even happen anytime soon. Hmm. It's kind of sad to see how few people know him, even though he was really famous once. Ugh, do I have to be on TV? I can't expect kids to watch a travel show about the countryside. What should I do? Anyway, what about your current job? Didn't you come here for something? Oh, that's right! Well, which song do you all want to hear? Make sure you decide by the next time I visit. We don't want to hear you sing. I want to go beat up that sheep demon outside instead. Is she a land broker? 
How annoying. She demon? I thought it was just a kid demon. Oh, yeah, there. The dark hero is the last stage. Of course it is. Um, and I'll do that one because I'm looking at the time on the recording and it's definitely uh, skewed because of uh, because of me speeding up the uh, grind example. I do like showing in an episode, if I did grind, how I grinded, just because I feel like it's, uh, it's just nice to show it. Huh? So it is a land broker. <laughs> you kept me waiting. Whoa. There's a lot of interesting people here. Oh? Those people in the back are... Bodyguards? Meow. That's right. Oh, God. So, if you look behind them, you can see the outlines going from left to right. Uh, Gordon Flan, uh, Midboss Laharl, I think that's Marjoli, which, uh, she's a DLC in this game, and a previous game, like, Superboss. And then Prism Red, I think. Whoa, hey, who are these familiar faces? I think I'm having deja vu or something. I can't believe they would go this far to get another part in the game. This is horrible. Yep. <laughs> Mr. Axel? Maybe he just received some kind of radio wave transmission. Even the aliens have their eyes set on Mr. Axel. We have something for you, you know? For me? I found him wandering around, so I decided to pick him up. <laughs> Bro! What? You slime ball! Taking my family hostage! Oh, I didn't know he's your family. What a lucky coincidence. Anyway, you can't make a single move, because we took your brother hostage. You can't talk to my bro like that! He's the dark hero! Oh, I remember now. You're Axel, right? I remember what you did during that live show. Oh, and wasn't this the kid who was taken hostage that time, too? What? A live show? Yeah, don't say any more. The same situation as that time. How ironic. I think it would feel a lot better if he just got beaten. Mr. Axel, oh, what are you gonna do? Meow. Are you gonna save him? Or are you going to neglect him? <laughs> neglect him? How could I? But if I do the same as last time, I'll have failed as the dark hero, and I'd end up crushing his nightmare. Damn it, what am I... What am I supposed to do? Screw you, bro! Axial? What are you confused about? Where did my dark hero go? You're the one who taught me that a dark hero must win using any dirty trick in the book. Huh. No matter what it looks like during the battle, a real dark hero will always be standing at the end, right? Yeah, you're right. I almost forgot what a dark hero stands for. Sorry, Axial. I didn't mean for you to see me like that. Now I'll show you the real dark hero spirit. You won't want to blink. Bro! Uh, oh, my heart problem is suddenly getting worse uh, without warning. I can't. I'm sorry. Huh? What just happened? Is he dead or... It's not fair! 
coming from the demon. Okay, so let's go over here. So we got Prism Red, we got Gordon, we got Marjoli, Legendary Witch, we have Laharl, we have Flan in Fallen Angel form. Okay, so let's check this out. 37th Defender of Earth attacks again if the first blow misses. Um, which is interesting because he's a monster type in this. Um, uh, uh, evil Witch whose power is laughter, takes less damage from girls. Uh, Overlord from another netherworld. A fallen angel who loves everything. And prison leader, the power of passion and justice. Okay. Well. Bam. Uh, okay. And I think I will. Oh, shit. <laughs> I meant to. Uh, I meant to go and change enemy effects on. good progress. This episode will be a little bit longer than other ones, but, you know, technically finishing a game, I guess, is a good reason enough. Okay. Okay, and then... Excuse me. And then we just have to take out Fawn. Delta split. That's just a bow attack. I was hoping for a, uh, more unique one. But, oh well. Okay, and then get back here. And you're dead. Get fucked. Did you see the real power of a dark hero? What the hell? You're pretty good. What sneakiness? You're so much better than the evil rangers. Hey, do you have like transformation kits? I want one too, for free! Whoa, 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 settle down, kids. I'll defeat you if you get too annoying. You see that, Axial? What do you think? Wasn't I cool? Yeah, you were so cool. You are my dark hero after all. Ah, you've grown so much too. So, a family makes you weaker and stronger at the same time. It's not that rare among angels or humans. But I guess it is among demons. Do you want a family now, too? Meow. Yeah, just a little. There you are, Axel, darling. How about that Veldite thing? You need your answer soon. Have you thought about it? Hey, Director. A dark hero must be standing and laughing at the end using any dirty trick to win, right? Yeah, that's what you used to say.
All right, I've decided. I'm going to Veldheim. Axel, darling. Who cares if it's the countryside? Who cares if it's a travel show? I'll make it into a hero show. I'll make up stories. I'm gonna climb my way back up. To make up stories, but don't go causing any trouble. I'm just glad you want to do this now. Oh, Axel, darling, I'm coming with you. Oh, yeah, Director? Well, let's fire things up again, together. Axel! Darling! We'll send you off from here. It's been really exciting. I'll be watching you from the shadows like a good sidekick. Meow. You guys were really good extras. I'll make sure to hire you when I'm back in business. Now, about the house. Axel, so you really are going? Ma, what, what are you doing here? I knew everything. How you weren't working, how you were hesitating to take this job. I was worried about you. Ma! Don't worry about the house. Just go. Just watching you on TV will make us happy. Just don't forget to call us, okay? Ma. Well, are you going really far away? Yeah, I know I can count on you to take good care of Ma. I know I'll be making a great TV appearance soon. It will change the netherworld, I promise. I know I never keep my word, but I will... Oh, sorry about that. Okay, bro. We'll be watching you. I promise you too. And that was Axo mode. A lot quicker than Etna mode. And honestly, I definitely prefer it over Etna mode. Just because um just because it's an additional it's like adding on to the story. Whereas Etna mode was an alternate story. I like this much better as well because there's less like reused assets in that like I don't believe you're ever going to encounter the dining room in Adele mode or the orphanage in Adele mode whereas in Etna mode it just used all the asset like you basically went to all the same places as regular mode and reused those assets reused some of the stages reused um, the same tile sets so I like this quite a bit and I also liked, uh, and I didn't realize it when I was younger that every, all of his siblings also had, like, Axel, or some form of that in the name, like, uh, Accident and Axial, and, uh, stuff like that. Uh, and I did remember the cat, but, uh, that, w and I remembered you got the cat, I remember you got the angel, I remember the angel was a masochist, I just didn't remember a lot of the specifics. Like, I was completely surprised by uh, the actress, because I completely forgot about her. Um, so this mode is very good, because I'll be able to use Magic Change in Adele mode, I'll be able to make the cat, make a Celestial Host, and make a dragon thing, if I so wanted. I never make monster types, though, because... Well, I don't want to say never, but rarely do I ever make monster types, just because the human-y type ones are so much more useful, because... You can, uh, you can get a healer with axe moves if you oh so wished, whereas monsters you're limited to the monster moves. So they're more useful as magic change items. But uh, nevertheless, this was uh, definitely a good mode, it was a good addition. Um, and I did like how they even included 
the Dark World for it. Because I remember in the regular one, you also have to find the five switches and get it. And it still has the same uh, way of... Uh, you have to do certain things on each map to unlock the Dark World form of that map. Uh, and I'm glad they included it in this as a form of grinding. And I'm glad that they included the uh, Nisa code which is what I call it, the uh, triangle, square, circle, triangle, square, circle, X, which uh, is just uh, that uh, same pattern, top, left, right, uh, top, left, right, bottom, uh, when you're uh, picking it on anything, whether it's with an Xbox controller or with the IJKL keys on, uh, on PC. So um, I like how they include that uh, similar to Etna mode, how you could do it before the main one. You didn't have to play it where the people were like level in their hundreds or more. Um, which I think is really nice. Especially because it has mechanics that unlock for the main game. Like, if you could only do this after the main game, then I would kind of call bullshit because it's like, well, that means you only got to use Magic Change for four chapters. And they're pretty short chapters. They don't even have like the normal amount of maps per chapter either. Um, and you weren't able to make, like, these three types of characters until you did this as well. Which I would also kind of be like, okay, that's not cool, because why would I make these now? Because I've I've been playing with all these other people, all these other characters, they're my main team, I don't need them. Um, so that's just where I'm uh, saying. But this picture is really nice, I like it. It really shows how similar looking the rest of his family looks. One year later. Has everyone seen the hit movie Mackay Wars Episode 2 yet? It was a huge box office smash. Because of what happened, they skipped the first one and went straight to the sequel. It broke all kinds of records. Now, please enjoy our interview with the main character. Well, I was too good to be the main character for this movie. I guess I caught the eye of the director. And I'm skilled, too. I've lived an exciting life. Mr. Axel, are you watching? We got famous before you did. <laughs> and just leave it with that. So the end. Um, not really the end. Uh, so we can be carried over to the next cycle. Which story do you want to play next? I want to play Adele's story. Yeah, I'll save. So uh, I'll be continuing with Adele's story next time. So with that, I hope you all have a very nice day, and will join me in the next episode. Bye.